Hello. In this lesson, I'm going to give you some examples of linear equations with one solution, infinitely many solutions, and no solutions. In general, one solution looks like AX plus B equals C, where A does not equal zero, B is some number, and C is a constant. I'm giving you two examples here. So you would solve by subtracting two from both sides, and you get 4x equals 8, then divide both sides by 4, and x equals 2. There is only one solution for this particular linear equation. Let's look at this one. We're going to add 4 to both sides. We're solving for the variable. And we get 3x equals 15. Divide both sides by 3. And the only solution is x equals 5. Infinite solutions means any number can solve this particular equation. You can eventually get to the form where 0 times x plus 7 equals 7, which would be 7 equals 7. So let's look here. If we get 4x minus 2 equals negative 8 plus 4x, if we simplified, we'd get 4x minus 8 equals negative 8 plus 4x. If we took away 4x from both sides, we could put it in the form of 0 times x minus 8 equals negative 8, or negative 8 equals negative 8. It does not matter what number you could substitute for x, the solution would be infinite because any number would make this equation true. And then there's a situation where you have no solutions. No solutions means it doesn't matter what number you use because this is impossible. Four, if you had 0 times x, that would be 0, plus 4 equals 3. 4 cannot equal 3, so there are no solutions. If I brought this down, you'd say 4 equals 3. We know that that is impossible. No solutions. So let's look here. 8x plus 2 equals, I mean 8r plus 2 equals 8r minus 7. To balance the equations, we subtract 8r from both sides. We'd get 2 equals negative 7. Or you could say 0 times r plus 2 equals negative 7. This is once again impossible. They do not equal because 2 does not equal negative 7. Looking here, 6q plus 6 equals 9 plus 6q. If we subtract 6q from both sides, we would get 6 equals 9. We know this is impossible. 6 does not equal 9, so there are no solutions for this equation. 